The last remaining two jet aircraft from Kim and Airways' Boeing 737-300 fleet have officially been retired from service to the Cayman Islands, marking another milestone in the National Airlines' current fleet modernization plan. Cayman Airways had operated 737-300 aircraft for three decades, with the last remaining aircraft, VPCKW and VPCKZ, being retired on October 18th and October 25th, 2021, respectively. A special farewell event was held in the Cayman Airways hangar on Grand Cayman on October 25th, attended by Cayman Airways board members, executives, employees, and government officials, including the Cayman Islands Premier, the Honorable Wayne Panton, and Minister for Tourism and Transport, the Honorable Kenneth Bryan. Everyone in attendance got the unique opportunity to write farewell messages on the nose of VPCKZ before its final departure, flown by Captain Perry Panton and First Officer Jeffrey Connolly. Both aircraft will be stored at the Southern California Logistics Airport in Victorville, pending sale. The airline's current fleet modernization plan has positioned Cayman Airways as having the youngest jet fleet in the region, after achieving the historic accolade in 2018 of being the first Caribbean-based airline to operate brand new, state-of-the-art Boeing 737-8 aircraft. The Cayman Airways fleet now consists of three brand new Boeing 737-8 jets, along with two Saab 340B Plus aircraft and two Twin Honor aircraft operated by Cayman Airways Express. With your KX News travel update, I'm Olivia Scott Ramirez.